Well, said to me, Tucker, was that uh, there may well have been political bias when it came time for the FBI to go get surveillance warrants on Carter Page. That's the Trump campaign aide who, aide who they uh, surveilled, who they eavesdropped on during the presidential campaign. We need to be really clear here. All the inspector general said in his report was that when they opened the case file, that he couldn't find any evidence of bias. But opening a case file is one thing. Actually going out and getting warrants, actually eavesdropping, that's something totally different. And the inspector general told me there very well could have been bias in that to circ in those circumstances. What's I mean, there's so many layers of irony here, but maybe the most obvious is the president was impeached yesterday because he talked to the president of Ukraine and mentioned potential malfeasance by the son of his potential political opponent in this campaign. And that's impeachable. The last administration literally pulled a FISA warrant on its political enemies, but that's no big deal. How does this work? Yeah. Oh, and it, it, you're absolutely right, Tucker. I mean, this is unprecedented in our history. The DNC, Democrat Party, paid for this dossier that we now know is totally fake. They fed it to the FBI, and the FBI used it and lied to a court, not once, not twice, not three times, four times, in order to intervene effectively in a presidential election to get a warrant to eavesdrop on a presidential campaign. And the Democrats knew this. During the campaign, they knew it. And so they got news stories written during the campaign that the FBI and other agencies were investigating Trump, trying to influence the election. It's absolutely extraordinary. And the FBI, there's, there's got to be major reform, uh, Tucker. We cannot allow this to keep happening. Really quick, would it be cool for the Trump DOJ to get FISA warrants on aides to Bernie Sanders for their ties to Venezuela, for example. Would that be, would that be all right, do you think? Uh, can you imagine what would happen if, if that were actually the case? Of course it I would be all right. It. it would be absolutely, it would be an abuse of power. It would be an right. abuse that's of right. power, and that's what happened when the FBI lied to the FISA court and used paid political opposition to go out and get surveillance warrants on a presidential campaign. Exactly. It seems very clear, and you certainly have expressed it clearly. We're, we're thankful for that. Senator, thanks so much for coming on tonight.